हाउ टू फिक्स विन थर्टी टू के बेस डॉट एस वाई एस ब्लू स्क्रीन एर इन विंडोज इलेवन हेलो फ्रेंड्स टू फिक्स दिस बी एस ओ डी फॉलो द स्टेप्स रन सिस्टम फाइल चेक क्लिक ऑन सर्च टाइप सी एम डी सिलेक्ट रन एज एडमिनिस्ट्रेटर टाइप एस एफ सी स्पेस फॉरवर्ड स्लेस स्कैन नाउ This process will take some time, so wait until the verification reaches hundred percent. Windows Source Protection did not find any integrity violations. Close the command prompt and other running tasks, and restart your computer. If the issue still occurs, use DISM tools. Again, open command prompt as administrator. Copy the DISM commands from description one by one. There are three commands in the description. Paste the first command. Press enter. No component to store corruption detected. Again, copy from the description and paste into command prompt and press enter. Once more, go to the video description and copy the last command from there. Paste into the command prompt and press enter. Once you have run all the three commands, this one, this one, and this one, close the command prompt. and close other files and restart check if the blue screen is fixed if the win 32k base dot sys blue screen is still showing you will have to run check disk utility again you will have to open command prompt for this purpose click on search because we have previously opened command prompt so this is showing in the recent section right click on this And select run as administrator. Type chk dsk space forward slash f space c colon and press enter. Chk dsk can not run because the volume is in use by another process. would you like to schedule this volume to be checked the next time the system restarts press y on your keyboard and press enter close the running tasks and restart your computer while restarting the chk dsk will work and show you the result check for windows updates if any pending windows updates are available install it click on start click on settings go to windows update and click on check for updates if you find any update here let it download after downloading is completed restart your computer for complete the installation that's all friends thanks for watching the video